Sid the Science Kid, also known as Jim Henson's Sid the Science Kid, is an American half-hour CGI animated series that aired on PBS Kids from September 1, 2008, to March 25, 2013, with a total of 68 half-hour episodes produced over two seasons. The computer-generated show is produced by the Jim Henson Company and then PBS member KCET in Los Angeles, California using the Henson Digital Puppetry Studio. The show is produced by Motion Capture which allows puppeteers to voice digitally animated characters in real time. Production began in the fall of 2008 with 42 half-hour episodes of Sid the Science Kid having been ordered. The series debuted on PBS Kids along with Martha Speaks on September 1, 2008, with a two-year on-air commitment. The original working title for the series was, What's the Big Idea? And the central character, Sid, was originally named Josh, K-O-C-E, the current primary PBS member for the Los Angeles area, began co-producing the show after KCET disaffiliated with PBS on December 31, 2010. Topic premise The main character in the show is Sid, an inquisitive youngster who uses comedy to tackle questions kids have about basic scientific principles and why things work the way they do. He tries to answer questions and solve problems with the help of his classmates May, Gerald, and Gabriella, teacher Susie, and his family his mother Alice, his father Mort, his grandma Rose and his baby brother Zeke. In Hello Doggy, Sid's grandma adopts a dog from the animal shelter, which she names Filbert, voiced by Bruce Lanoil, motion captured by Daisy the dog. The conceptual content of Sid is based in national science learning standards, cognitive learning theory, and on the preschool science curriculum, preschool pathways to science. Each week's episodes are built around a single scientific theme or concept. The first week episodes 1 to 5 focuses on scientific tools and concepts such as charts, observation, estimation, and measuring. The second week episodes 6 to 10 focuses on changes and transformation including decay, growth, freezing and melting, and the effects of heat. The third week episodes 11 to 15 focuses on the senses including touch, smell, sight, and hearing. The fourth week episodes 16 to 20 focuses on health. The fifth week episodes 21 to 25 focuses on simple machines. The sixth week episodes 26 to 30 focuses on backyard science. The seventh week episodes 31 to 35 focuses on the human body. The eighth week episodes 36 to 40 focuses on weather. The Friday shows are designed to review, reinforce and summarize the central concept of the week. One recurring segment, Good Afternoon, features the kids opening panels in a brightly colored playground structure and telling jokes. The format and set borrow heavily from the closing joke wall of Rowan and Martin's Laugh-In, the groaning wall from Square One TV, and locker jokes from You Can't Do That on Television, but for a preschool audience and Sid would end the segment by saying, Now that's funny, along with a pre-recorded laughter from his toy microphone. Other recurring segments include What's the Big Idea? A problem that Sid has with anything that has to do something with the problem, Breakfast Time, when either Alice or Mort teaches Sid something that has anything to do with the problem, The Sid Survey, the segment where Sid asks questions to May, Gerald, and Gabriella, Rug Time, where Sid shows his friends and his teacher something with the problem, The Super Fab Lab, where the scientists do the lab along with a live action class in fast motion performing the experiment of the day playtime whenever the class finished an experiment the kids would either play in the classroom or on the playground 
Singing with Susie, where Susie sings a song related to the experiment or theme. Backseat driving with Grandma, scientist in the house, when Sid solves the problem and or plays with his family after school, and Sid's super duper ooper schmooper big idea, where Sid would think about what will he do to solve a problem like the one he had from each episode. Sometimes, Sid would have his play date with Gabriella or May after school making it two scientists in the house. Topic. Characters Sid motion captured by Misty Roses, voiced by Drew Massey wants to be a scientist when he grows up. Sid is the most practical character on the show and is often portrayed as a very supportive friend. His special item is a toy microphone with four different colored buttons. When pressed, the blue button plays the recorded laughter of people, the yellow button plays the recorded applause, the red button makes a cow noise, and the white button records echoes. He wants to know everything about everything. He enjoys singing and dancing as well. He is a well-noted observer, and possibly the brightest of the group. His daily activities consist of playing in his room, coming up with a question, asking people about his question, studying his question in school, going home, and presenting his super duper ooper schmooper big idea. Sid's mother is of African descent and his father grew up Jewish as noted in the Hanukkah, Christmas, Kwanzaa episode. May motion captured by Dana Michael Woods, voiced by Julianne Buescher is one of Sid's best friends, marked by her striped stockings and fairness. She is shown to have terrible eyesight. She is the most sentimental character of the group. She is very polite and is characterized by her charming, courteous ways. May often sympathizes with everyone and everything, appreciating even inanimate things like decayed pumpkins and brown, mushy bananas. May has a cat named Mushu. While her conduct is quite silly at times, May is exceptionally smart. Gerald motion captured by Alan Williams, voiced by Victor Yared, is Sid's airhead, vivacious best friend. He often stalls at the start of rug time, attempting a very appreciated light-humored gig. He has a dog, a Jack Russell Terrier called Chester. He is a very valued character of the quartet, perhaps the most vivid character of the group, often being the life and soul of activities. A running gag is that he is always trying to be funny, but fails miserably. Gabriella Cordova motion captured by John Monroe Cameron, voiced by Alice Dinian Vernon is yet one of the three best friends Sid got. Unlike her friends, Gabriella is the most sensible character and often comes up with the most reasonable jokes during Good Laughternoon. She is the most authoritative figure of the quartet, often being the leader of the group activities. She is usually the one to propose playing pretend, always opting to be the mommy. She can allegedly read. Sometimes she comes over to Sid's house to have a play date with him. She has an older brother named Matteo. Susie motion captured by Sonia Leslie, voiced by Donna Kimball is the Mexican-accented teacher at Sid's school. She begins the day with rug time where she summons the children to sit in a circle and asks them if they have anything to share with the class or talk about usually the topic brought up is what was discussed during Sid's survey and what Sid was thinking about earlier in the day. She conducts the experiments with her class. She sings to the children during the Singing with Susie segment at the end of the school day. Mort motion captured by John Monroe Cameron, voiced by Victor Yared, is Sid's father. Mort works in construction and often relates Sid's observations to his work experiences. 
Alice motion captured by Sonia Leslie, voiced by Alice Dinian Vernon, is Sid's mother who drives him to school each day. Alice is a website designer and children's computer game developer episode 58 The Amazing Computer Science Tool. Her name is probably an allusion to her voice actress. Rose Sid's grandma motion captured by Dana Michael Woods, voiced by Julianne Buescher and Donna Kimball is Sid's paternal grandmother. She likes to tell Sid stories about herself when she was younger while driving home from school. Dr. Rosalinda Cordova motion captured by Michelin Sisti, voiced by America Ferreira is a research scientist at the Science Center that the children often visit, and the mother of Gabriella. She helps to explain the various exhibits at the center and how they relate to the school lessons the children are having. On occasion, she will visit the children in their schoolroom and teach alongside teacher Susie. She is very proud of her daughter Gabriella. Zeke motion captured by Alan Williams, voiced by Donna Kimball, is Sid's baby brother. He's 10 months old. Topic: Episodes. Topic: Season 1, 2008-2009 Tools and Measurements 1. The Sticker Chart – Charts September 1, 2008 2. The Roly-Poly – Observation – Magnification September 2, 2008 3. Enough with the seashells, estimation, September 3, 2008. 4. The whale episode, non-standard measurement, September 4, 2008. 5. Super science tools, tools and measurements review, September 5, 2008. Changes and transformations. 6. My Mushy Banana Decay September 8, 2008 7. My Shrinking Shoes Growth September 9, 2008 8. My Ice Pops Reversible Transformation Ice September 10, 2008 9. The Perfect Pancake Irreversible Transformation Heat September 11, 2008 10. No More Changes, Changes and Transformations Review, September 12, 2008 Senses. 11. The Itchy Tag, Texture, Touch, Feel, September 22, 2008. 12. What's That Smell, Smelling, September 23, 2008. 13. Grandma's Glasses Sight Vision September 24, 2008 14 Too Much Noise Hearing September 25, 2008 15 All My Senses Senses Review September 26, 2008 Health 16 A Brush With Teeth Dental Hygiene October 20, 2008 17. I Want Cake Healthy Food Groups October 21, 2008 18. The Big Sneeze Germs October 22, 2008 19. Must See TV Exercise, Fitness October 23, 2008 20. Sid's Health Day Health Review October 24, 2008 Simple Machines 21 The Broken Wheel Wheels February 9, 2009 22 My Slide Inclined Planes February 10, 2009 23 Sid's Amazing Invention Levers February 11, 2009 24. The Treehouse Pulleys, February 12, 2009. 25. 
Climb, Ignitz, Climb, Simple Machines Review February 13, 2009 Backyard Science 26. Hello, Doggy, Animal Communication February 16, 2009 27. Home Tweet Home Animal Homes February 17, 2009 28. The Dirt on Dirt Dirt, Soil, Mud February 18, 2009 29. Don't forget the leaves, leaves, February 19, 2009. 30. The Bug Club, Backyard Science Review, February 20, 2009. The Body. 31. Special Mom Day Meal, Stomachs, May 4, 2009. 32. I Have Muscles Wear, Muscles, May 5, 2009. 33. Sid's Amazing Lungs, Lungs, May 6, 2009. 34. How Did My Dog Do That? Bones, Skeletons, May 7, 2009. 35. Now That's Using Your Brain, Brains, May 8, 2009. Weather. 36. Sid's Rainy Play Date Rain, Thunder, Lighting September 14, 2009 37. Special Sunny Dad Day Sun, Hot September 15, 2009 38. Sid's Holiday Adventure Snow, Cold, Ice September 16, 2009 39. The Wind Did It Wind September 17, 2009 40 Sid the Weatherman Weather Review September 18, 2009 Topic Season 2 2010 to 2012 Force and Motion 43 Slide to the side, friction, October 4, 2010. 44. That's the way the ball bounces, elasticity, October 5, 2010. 45. Ignitz's inertia, inertia, October 6, 2010. 46. Sid's super kick, force, October 7, 2010. Light and shadow. 47. Let There Be Light, Light, November 8, 2010. 48. Discovering Darkness, Dark, November 9, 2010. 49. Shadow Smile, Shadows, November 10, 2010. 50. A Rainbow Every Day, Rainbows, November 11, 2010. Environmental Systems. 51. Where did the water go? Water, April 18, 2011. 52. Clean air, air, trees, April 19, 2011. 53. Reused robot, recycling, trash, April 20, 2011. 54. Save the stump, habitats, April 21, 2011. Technology and engineering. 58. The Amazing Computer Science Tool, Computers, December 6, 2011. 59. The Big Cheese, Research, December 7, 2011. 60. Sid Wings It, Flight, December 8, 2011. 61. Sid Engineers a Solution, Engineering, December 9, 2011. Living Things. 64. Sid's Pet Project, Pets, Responsibility, January 23, 2012. 65. Sleep. Who Needs It, Sleep, January 24, 2012. 66. Seed the Science Kid, Seeds, Life Cycles, January 25, 2012. 67. 
The reason Sid Sneezen allergies January 26, 2012 season 1 minus 2 specials 2009 to 12. Season 1 41 Getting a shot you can do it vaccination October 26, 2009 season 2 42 no school sing along special sing along music June 21st 2010 55 Sid's backyard campout camping June 20th 2011 56 Halloween spooky science special Halloween spiders bats skeletons cats October 17th 2011 57 I want to be a scientist, wildlife biologist, robotics engineer, chemist, astronaut, December 5, 2011 62. Get up and move, body movement, January 6, 2012 63. Rock and roll Easter, rocks, April 3, 2012 Topic. Sid the Science Kid, the movie, 2013. Sid the Science Kid, the movie premiered on March 25, 2013. It featured the original voice cast of the show, with special guest voice Christopher Lloyd as Dr. Bonadon. In the movie, Sid and his friends enter a contest and win a trip to a new science museum in town. They are allowed inside the museum before it officially opens to the public. Along the way, they meet some new friends, such as Yang Yang, Niu Niu, and Bobby Bot. However, one of the robots malfunctions, causing the museum to be in total chaos and havoc, putting the grand opening of the museum in jeopardy. It's up to Sid and his friends to save the museum before it opens up. Topic. Awards Save the Stump won in the Children's Programming category Saturday at the 26th Genesis Awards, presented by the Humane Society of the United States. Additionally, the series has received a total of six Daytime Emmy Award nominations and a TCA Award nomination. Topic. See also Bill Nye the Science Guy